Here we go. Full throttle. And... Oh, God! Oh, I did a kickflip! Dude, that was amazing! No, that is not a jump fail. That was a complete success. I expected to be in the water there. All right, ladies and gentlemen, Dre here, and today I'm an American fugitive. Today we're going to be checking out this brand new GTA-like game that came out. And as you can probably tell, it's top-down, so it's very much like the classic GTAs that's obviously updated with current-gen graphics. So I'm so excited for this. Uh, I'm Obviously, I love GTA games. I'm sure most of you do as well. And uh, yeah, this one's looking pretty good. So the, the quick story behind what's going on right now, my father called me. He was in a panic. I went over to his house and broke in because he wasn't answering the door. And then I found him dead and the cops came in and claimed that I did the crime. So now I'm fed up with prison. We're getting the hell out of it because I'm not actually a criminal at all. And basically, we're escaping prison right now. And yeah, I'm really not going to focus too much on the storyline. I do not want to spoil it for you guys that do want to get this game. So we're just going to have some fun today in a GTA-like game. All right, so it looks like we got to go through this tunnel here, but I do need to find a crowbar. What was that? There's actually something here. Oh, I can eat a mushroom. Maybe I shouldn't eat random wild mushrooms. That's probably a little dangerous. All right, but we got a building here, so let's um, peek inside, make sure there's nobody inside, and we got to figure out how we're going to get in unoccupied, so that's good. Yeah, I can't break into it without a blunt object, so there should be something. Oh, look at that. Perfect. We got a brick. All right, we're going to smash that window, get inside, and hopefully there's a crowbar in here. I'm assuming there is, or this wouldn't be here, because we're kind of in a tutorial right now, let's be honest. All right, would you look at that? Crowbar, apple, soda, and a bandage. All the things you need as a new player. Isn't that convenient? In one little shed. Okay, so now we should be able to get through this pipe, and hopefully on the other side, the cops won't be looking for us. Now, the only other thing we probably need is some sort of clothing, because we definitely have a prison suit on right now. All right, here we go. Okay, and as assumed, that's what we got to do next. All right, so we're going to go down. We got two options here. Now, I cannot be seen, though, so let's sprint across this road. Please, nobody see me. And look at that. Got some clothes right here we can steal. Okay, so we're going to take that. Uh, blue shirt and jeans. Wait, I can... Wait, I can wear a dress? Oh, you know I'm wearing a dress instead. Hell yeah, dude. <laughs> oh, this game's great already. I wonder if people will be alarmed by me wearing a dress. You know what? Who cares? I want to wear a dress, damn it, and it's 2019, and I can do that if I want to. Oh, hey, look. We've got a random RV by the railroad tracks here. Can we uh, peek inside, see if anybody's in there? Uh, it, oh, yep, yeah, it's occupied. Okay, well, we're not going to bother that then. I just got out of prison. Let's not, you know, be too risky just yet. As I say that, it's really tempting to steal this car right now. I can do that if I want to, but I'm not going to. Can I, uh, I wonder what I can do with, like, random people. Hello, sir. Can I hit you or something? I'm not going to hit you, but I'm just trying to learn how to play. What kind of parking job is this? You know what? You deserve to be stolen. So let's just, uh, look, it's unlocked and everything. Sick. All right, let's try some off-roading here. Oh, sorry about that lamppost. Okay, I like the physics already, though. That feels good. And I got to say, the car feels great as well. It's uh, got some very big wheels on it, so it's kind of hard to control. Whoa! Okay, the physics are great in this. Can I, uh, just out of curiosity, can I smash through, like, buildings? No, okay. It's, it's, it's not that good, unfortunately. But yeah, this is great, man. I've actually been surprised that they're... Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. We are looking like crazy breaking that thing. I've actually been surprised that there's not, like, more GTA-like top-down games, though, because it was such a cool premise, and I'm actually kind of sad that GTA went away from it. Uh, I mean, I understand why they did. Jesus, I am not very good at driving. But it would have been nice to have an option for a top-down version as well. Okay, we got a cop here. Let's act cool. We got to go over here and meet somebody. So, uh, going to kind of do the storyline, but like I said, I'm not going to focus on it. All right, though, that is my kind of car. So I think I'm supposed to steal this, and I'm totally fine with that. We can totally steal a cool-looking muscle car. Actually, this is the car, like I said, we're not going much in the storyline, but this was the car that was at my father's house, I believe, when I went there. Uh, oh, yeah, look at that. This is definitely the car I saw that night. So, yeah, this is clearly the criminal's car. So we're getting deeper into it. No problem at all really driving around. Whoops, sorry, sir. Didn't mean to do that. But yeah, really, really fun. Crime report, traffic accident. Okay, that, that was me. You know, I only got one star, though, so I should be able to get, a, get away from them. Let's go down. Oh, God. Here we go. First uh, police chase of the day. This should be fun. At least I'm in a fast car. 
All right, let's go down the railroad tracks here. I do have a couple cops on me. Oh, actually, I'm getting stuck. I wonder if I should just wait here. This might actually might, might be a pretty good spot. And yes, cops are off me, so that was a complete success. I've noticed this is a jump over here, too. We gotta try a good old jump, so we're not gonna be able to get too much of a head start or speed up, but we can play some Dukes of Hazard right now, and there we go. Hey, not bad, not bad. Oh, there we go, jump complete distance. 37, new record, hell yeah. All right, so looking at the map, it's no GTA, that's for sure, in terms of size, but this is what we have at our disposal right now. So it looks like we can go get some clothes. I'm looking for exactly that. We got some guns here. Now, I don't have too much money, but I did do one quest, so hopefully that's enough. I gotta get an another vehicle, though, so it looks like this one right here might be suffice. Just a guy in a, in a, in a dress stealing cars, no big deal. Can I use this thing? Uh... <laughs> Oh my god, I can! Okay, so can I just totally destroy this? Oh my god. Okay, I'm way more impressed with this game now. Uh, we're gonna lower that magnet. Oh, it's a little wobbly. There we go, direct hit though. I probably should just use this car to drive around, but hey, this is too cool not to do. So, oh, can I crush it? Wait, can I actually crush it? Okay, so this is a great way to obviously hide cars you steal. There we go, get in there. And <laughs> Oh, I needed that, but that was so worth it. And there she comes in a block. All right, well, at least we know how to hide the evidence now when we need to. Where is this on the map? Right over here. Oh, okay. Cool, so you can't stop cars like GTA. They, they just run you over here, unless that, that was a glitch. Damn it. Oh, God, please don't do it. Please don't do it. Okay. Uh, uh, oh, God. Oh, God. Am I okay? Okay, it, clearly this is not going to work, so uh, it's going to be a lot harder to get cars in this game. <laughs> Idiots are looking for me, and I'm right at their police station. <laughs> they should probably come here. Oh, uh, God damn it! Okay, thank God he didn't see me. Oh, oh, oh God. Okay, you know what? Maybe we should, uh... I kind of want to see if we get hit by trains. Of course we get hit by trains. What am I saying? There we go. This is how I get out of here, though. See you later, suckers. Ow. I... <laughs> I just took it over some tombstones. What, what can we do with this? Oh, read it. Okay. Kissy Sissy, Birmingham. Gone but never forgotten. What about the ones that I actually hit? Can I read those? I guess I can't read them anymore, so we'll never know who that is. I'm sorry, dude, though. All right, clearly I need to relieve me of my sins as well as get away from the cops. So we're going to go into, uh, yeah, the old church here. So we can actually search the church. Can I steal things from the church? That's not wrong. I'm going to do it. A hidden stash? Oh yeah, 200 bucks, there we go. Okay, this is great. This is great, I don't, I don't even need to do missions. I'm just gonna steal everything that, that I need. There we go, and I think, oh crap, the, the cops are still onto us. You know what, maybe we should wait, wait it out in there. Uh, this is the world's smallest shed, please be something. Oh wow, okay, actually we could definitely use the baseball bat. Um, I only have 20 kgs of space though, so I'm thinking actually we'll take the lead pipe instead. I already have a wrench, so we're done with that. All right, so that was worth it. So I definitely want to try and, you know, burgle some houses and whatnot. Uh, but I do want to get a gun first, just in case, you know? Never know when you're going to need that. And can you swim? You can indeed swim as well. It actually looks like I'm faster swimming than walking. Oh! Hello? Come back! Oh, no. Are you serious? You drowned that quick? God damn it. You're arrested or wasted. You'll restart near another outlet pipe. Well, I'm not arrested or wasted. Well, I guess technically I'm wasted if they use the same thing as GTA, as in dead. And yes, they do. God damn it! This is what I get for going in the water. Okay, look at this. Convenience. This must be the gun guy. So, uh, yeah, country guns. We're gonna enter this place. Hopefully I have enough. 50... God damn. Okay, um... Actually, that doesn't even make any sense at all. 50 bucks for the gun. 50 bucks for the shells. What the hell? All right, well, I'm not gonna complain because I actually have enough. I'm thinking actually we should go shotgun then, maybe. We can actually go all the way to the AK if we really wanted to. Yeah, you know what? Let's do that. Item is locked. Never mind. It's locked. That's unfortunate. It looks like it's very hard to tell. Oh, are these? Oh, sorry. I must have had the wrong one. And we need some rifle rounds, so let's buy two of those. Uh, looks like we can only buy one. All right. That doesn't matter. We got the gun that I wanted, so now we can go burgle some places and look at this car that we get as well. So yeah, I was wearing... Okay, we're gonna have to find some clothes. This is just too weird right now. Oh, suspect spotted male in his underwear. <laughs> I'm sorry! I Okay, you know what? Maybe I should wear this again. 
See, now now I look like a convict. It's the fugitive. Oh, god damn it. What the hell happened to my dress? My my beautiful dress. Okay, I'm, I'm not going to steal that car because I have too much heat right now. I need to go find a clothesline. So yeah, it seems like when you die, it resets you to your original clothing, but it doesn't look like you're wearing your original clothing. So now we know. Let's not make that mistake again. Oh, God. What? I don't even have stars on me. Okay, this is all broken right now. Uh, I gotta decide what I want to do here. This is this is really weird right now. I'm running away from a cop in my underwear. Okay, he looks like he's stuck. Don't shoot me. Please don't shoot me. I'm just trying to get close. No, no clotheslines? Oh, you got a clothesline, but there's no clothes on it. I hate you so much right now. We're, we're gonna eat that. Let's just relax for a second. All right, there's a few houses here. I, I don't want to break into anything yet until I find some clothes. Doesn't look good on this side. I think that was the... There's only two homes, it looks like. All right, so hopefully nobody hears this. They probably will. I just want some clothes, man. That's all I want. Damn it. Yeah, I got uh, 120 seconds. Okay, so we're going to search this place. Hopefully we don't get shot at. Yes! Another dress. Just what I wanted. Now, do I want to search some more? Yeah, I know. We, we have time. Let's do it. Let's do it. Search. Uh, oh, wow. Okay, it speeds up when we're actually searching. A gun! And a toy car. Unfortunately, it's not a real car, but hey, that's okay. I got my dress, though, so <laughs> we're good. I love that I found another dress. Oh, God! Come on, copper! E even you guys are out to kill me. Hey, lady. You have a very nice dress. Is this your car? I was gonna steal that. I, 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 I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but you're you're basically me, so this is this isn't illegal at all. Oh god, carjacking. Yep. Oh, there we go. All right, at, le at least we're in a fast car now. I put a bank on the map. I want to see if we can maybe rob a bank. Obviously, we need to get the cops off of us first, so let's focus on doing that. But yes, if we could rob a bank, that would be amazing. We've done a lot today, a lot of crime, and that feels pretty good. Uh, I do gotta get, you know what, probably chilling over here should be okay. I don't think there's gonna be cops hanging out at a mine. Okay, so I was heading to another body shop, but this one is conveniently located here. So, repair and respay vehicle for 25 bucks. Can I change the color? That's the whole goal here. Hopefully it did change the color. What? Oh, Jesus! Um, the police are too close. <laughs> what just happened? I didn't have any stars on me. Excuse me, cop. I'll be back here in a little bit. I was trying to uh, hide my cover, but somehow he saw me. I have no idea what just happened there. Oh, God. Jesus. Okay, let's try this for the second time. I'm going to accept that. And now we should be good. Now, let's go. Uh, we got the bank on the map. It's actually quite a bit in this game, as you can see. I'm more interested in the bank right now, which is right here. So we are going to pay that a visit and see if we can possibly rob it. All right, Red Rock Bank. Looks like a nice little place here. Maybe we should wait till nighttime. Yeah, there's a lot of people here. This is probably... Let's just see what we can do at the bank right now. And kind of scope out the place. Oh my god, I am freaking muscle man here. Look, look at this. Let me just fix your garden for you. There you go. All right, secure lock, use keys. Oh god. Entry requires a security guard clothing. Okay, maybe we can somehow kill a security guard? Oh my god, I, I don't know how to aim. Oh god, is this... There's gotta be a way to aim, right? What? How do I... Can I not kill this guy? Oh my god, this is embarrassing. I should have just hit him. All right, we're gonna equip the uh, crowbar here. Oh yeah, there we go. This will be better. Got him! Okay, search. Where? Out of here! Oh my god, this might actually work. Clearly I can't use guns very well, but I'm pretty good with a crowbar. So, cops are already off me. That's good. I don't know if they'll be alarmed if they see a random guy in a security uniform. All right, I've waited out the place a little bit. Nobody seems too alarmed about me around, so I'm assuming I still need a key, but I think we're one step closer. Maybe in the car it has a key. Use keys, yeah. Entry requires... See, I searched the security guard. He didn't have a key on him. I don't think you can search cars, though. Oh, this is a mail truck? This guy's a mailman?! This whole time, I thought this was like a bank truck. Are you serious? So this isn't even a security guard. Wait, it didn't actually say I need a security guard uniform, though, so technically this will work. Oh, no, it, it, it did say that. I'm, I'm clearly crazy. God damn it! So I just spent all my ammo to kill a mailman. The, Jesus, are you guys... are you guys okay? So yeah, the whole robbing the bank thing, we'll have to get back to that. That's probably going to be a little bit more of a big deal than just simply getting a security guard uniform, which I don't know where... Oh, you think I should? I wonder if I could. I mean, we're in a pretty fast car. I gotta try it, man. We're gonna go from over here. This should give us hopefully enough speed. 
I don't know if we have enough speed. It's a pretty big jump. We're going to try it, though. Here we go. Full throttle. And... Oh, God! Oh, I did a kickflip! Dude, that was amazing! No, that is not a jump fail. That was a complete success. I expected to be in the water there. Well, you know what we got to do again? We got to hide this evidence. We do have a dead body in here after all, and uh, I'd like to get rid of that. So we figured out what this thing's used for now. That's for damn sure. And uh, yeah, it was a pretty successful day. We didn't really do much besides kill a mailman, but hey, it's my first day being a fugitive. So uh, that, that was pretty damn fun to me, honestly. But yeah, let's lower that magnet down. Good enough for me. Bring this over here. And, oh, easy now, easy now. Don't don't break it just yet. Yeah, there we go. Oh, God, is that really not going to work? Oh, yeah, I think we have to go in the other... No, we don't have to go in the other thing. We have to make sure this is right. That's it. Now we got it done, and the evidence is hidden. All right, guys, so I hope you guys enjoyed this quick look at American Fugitive. Now, like I said, there's a whole story beyond, behind this game as well, so if you guys are curious about it, I hope you guys enjoyed this first episode, and let me know if you guys want to see some more of this, because I love open-world games where you can do whatever the hell you want, and uh, it's great to have another top-down one. So, yeah, as always, guys, thanks for watching and liking, <laughs> and I'll see you... Whoa, that's impressive. I didn't even fall. In the next one.